RT4 once again with NASCAR 08. And in this episode of our season with David Rudman's Double Zero Burger King Toyota Camry, we are going to be completing race 13 of 36, which is going to take place at Dover International Speedway for the Dover 400. In the last episode, we raced at Lowe's Motor Speedway for the Coca-Cola 600, and we wound up finishing quite well in that race. But that car was just terrible. I got PTSD because of that car now. And I want to forget about it. Next time we go to Charlotte later in, on in the season, I'm probably going to drop the wedge even more. Because that car was tight all race long. It surprises me that I wound up getting in a fourth place finish, if I'm correct. Now, Dover is the Monster Mile. Um, this race was brought to you by the Cookie Monster. And Michael Mrugs, because this is his home track. And it's not only brought to him by Michael Mrugs. I am bringing Michael Mrugs to you on my channel right here. Howdy ho! Okay, so you can tell about your channel while we acknowledge the fact that this race is, uh, the, well, this race, this track has a fastest lap set by someone that doesn't exist. Kyle Busch is going to be starting on the pole. Yuck! That's always nice. And then Matt Kenseth in second. Kyle, not Kyle Busch. We all, well, okay, Kyle Busch is in first and third. Nice job, JC. Kurt Busch <laughs> is in third. I am so flustered right now. David Gillen going to be starting in... Fourth, Jeff. How Gordon, did that fifth, happen? Dylan Hart Jr. Sixth, Mark Martin seventh, Michael Waltrip eighth, Jeff Green ninth, and Ryan Newman's gonna be starting in tenth. So, there's my teammate Michael Waltrip. Where is Dale Jarrett, my other teammate, who's been trying to make his way up into, I guess, the top twenty or making it to the chase? He's been moving forward quite a bit the past few races, but I can't find him. Whoa, there's whoa, 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 whoa! What is Jimmy doing in 29th? You no, know, this is his best track, and uh, you would know that. Yeah. This game's. Uh, this game is trash. Not being consistent or realistic. <laughs> Dale mm. Jarrett's gonna be starting in 37th. Okay, that's not that a surprise. Is uh, disappointing. I mean, maybe he can pass 36 cars. That'd always be nice. We're gonna start from the tail of the field like we always do. I'm gonna spin my tires at the restart because I suck. You go ahead and tell them about your channel and who you are. Okay. Aside from the screaming, I suppose. And besides, besides from oh, the no. screaming, what what oh, are you no. doing right now? You're bringing out a caution immediately. All right. Um, I can't go. I, I just can't go. <laughs> I, I why can't I go, game? That's that's not fair. You can't do this to me. I I am like a quarter of the track behind now. I kept <laughs> you, feathering the throttle. You got a lot of work to do. That's not working. Okay, now let me talk about while. me. Um, In the meantime. Hi, I'm, I'm Michael. I have a YouTube channel, Michael Roots, and I like to race a lot. So, yeah. And I'm here to support my good buddy, JC, who, uh, who's he catching races, some people now. He screams. I'm oh, yeah, I, I rage a lot. I scream a lot. I could not handle that start of the race whatsoever. Like if that would have been and now me, the game is not the controller would have been through I don't the TV. That. Somebody just DNF, so I'm automatically not in last place anymore. Oh, thank it was God. Scott Riggs. Who the hell was it? Yay! I'm not it was Scott Riggs. Oh, I missed it. I'm and sorry. I I'm a horrible announcer. In 40 second now, I'm not in last place. I'm in the top 42. This is great. My tires are worn, and I have not made up a single position aside from the guy that just DNF. You're getting there, though. This is, uh, this is, uh, why, how do every time I have a collab, something has to go wrong? This time, I spin the tires so bad at the start of the race, the game refuses to let me stop spinning the tires. Oh. Are you really blocking me for 41st place? Yes, he is. Jeff Burton, bitch! Jeff Burton. Get I have an amusing I'm anecdote drive through about this field him. like it's. I'm gonna drive through the field like it's nothing now. That bitch did now not the tire is taking a toll on my ability to drive. By the way. Eh. You look like yeah, a I'm tremendous on. driver. I'm on the move. What the hell did y'all hit the brakes for so hard right there? So, what's upcoming for your channel that I should know about so I can take my mind off how pissed off I am? <laughs> um. Well, I did a video today. About I did a try not to curse challenge. Um, that's that's not possible. I, it it, it um, did not I don't go well. In you on that one. <laughs> but my uh, the 
the punishment if I fail the try not to curse challenge is I have to tweet Kyle Bush a love letter on Valentine's Day. So uh, see if I if I passed or not by watching that video. My car is so loose because of the tire wear. It'll really surprise me if I get a top 10 in this race. I honestly don't think that's even possible anymore. You must Not believe if you're to achieve. I don't want to hear any Have of this finished? pessimistic stuff. If I'm correct, I've gotten a top 5 and not a top 5, but a top 10 in every single race that we've done in this season yet. And this race is in no way going to make sure I confirm hey, that. Hey, I'm trying hey. not to hit Jimmy Johnson, but this car is Don't you hit Jimmy! Okay, no contact was made in that situation. Now, I will not die in the video that is a collab. Uh, Dale Jarrett is in 22nd. Wow. I don't know if he's really making up any positions right now. He started in like 37th. Okay, so I guess that's nice. Now, what about Michael Waltrip? Michael Waltrip started in 8th, uh, right? I don't know. So hopefully he's still making it to the top 5. We got two Joe Gibbs drivers. Right here, Whoa. Tony Stewart, JJ Yaley, and my car is so loose because of this tire wear. Pretty soon we're gonna be halfway. I'm trying yeah, we're almost to correct it through. without hitting anybody, but it's like if I want to correct it, I have to turn up into somebody. It's like I don't have the room to correct my car. I guess that's what it's gonna be. Well, there ain't nothing wrong with that. Uh, I said it once, I'll say it again. Anytime I have to do a collapse, something goes very awfully wrong, whether it's just in the attempt to record the video, or like the actual race that I'm trying to do itself. Right now, yeah, um, I spun the tires at the start of the race and got sent so many laps away from progress. I just want to point out that that bushy bushy <laughs> bitch that started on the pole, you just passed him, so yeah. Did he go down pit road? or I don't know. He... He's just a bitch. Oh, Kyle Busch. Wait, Kyle Busch started on the pole, and he is in freaking 19th like, place or whatever that is. Yeah. Right? I didn't even realize I passed him. I wasn't thinking about it. I'm just passing cars like they're cars instead of actual drivers. See, and you're like, I want to restart the race. I'm all sad. But look at you now. Yeah, we're probably going to lose a bunch of positions on pit road. That's one thing I'm guessing at. Okay, they're going down pit road. My car won't stop being loose. I don't want to take a pit stop right now, car. Okay. That oh my car God, wanted they're to make a pit because stop. of the pit stops. We're getting low on fuel. Um, the tires are very worn. I can feel that. I'm going way up the track all of a sudden. Go down the track. Go, go down the track. It's like the front of the car wants to go down the track, but the back of the car wants to go to the top of the track. That's how I feel right now. Okay, I'm going to go to pit road. Uh, oh, my God. Uh, uh, if they let me down there. Nah. They let me down nah. there. Perfection. I got down pit road sixth place. Uh, I'm not gonna repair damage. That is a lot of time that'd be wasted. Now four tires, full tank of fuel, and um, well, car feels fine except for whenever the tires are worn. You know, I said this race might be better or more entertaining than the eleventh race and the twelfth race, the ones at Darlington and Charlotte. But right now, this this is kind of embarrassing. That was the most embarrassing start I've had to any race at all on my entire channel. I'm glad I could be here for it, JC. I I honestly thought that I would just spin the tires a little and get going, but no, I never got going. It took me the entire existence of the front stretch. This monster mile is it's a monster bitch. <laughs> and I have no room to get on the track right now. I'm trying. Oh I'm God. trying to get on the track. You stupid fucking car, let me drive. Oh my goodness, I can't do this anymore. I can't, I can't play this game anymore. It's given, it's given me um, this... Burger King style of cancer that I can't explain. I, I haven't played this in a while. 14th, 15th, and but there's it's no one down pit road anymore. It's giving me some bad flashbacks. I've been actually catching these guys, and I think once I catch them, I can bump draft a little to make my way through the field a little faster. But right now, Mark Martin is in the lead, and this race is just, it really is awful in terms of racing. Um, I guess it was okay once we finally caught the field, but... This race, um, this race went south, like way, way south in comparison to where Dover actually is in the United States. <laughs> okay, we got I mean, there. Fifteenth isn't horrible. That was I. I want to get a top ten. I think I can do it. Don't. Why did the AI do that in these games? 
because they come pitches. down into turn one whether you're there or not. That's in a lot of EA games. I don't know why. Okay, I'm letting off the gas so I can get to the bottom. Okay, I'm gonna push JJ Illy, and we're gonna see if we can get a top ten, maybe even a top five because all those cars are packed together right there. You can do uh, it. Uh, I tried. I wanted to push him, but you're he getting there. Outside for some reason. Okay, I don't think it's going to take me any more than like three laps to catch these guys in front of us. My car is getting tight. It won't stay to the bottom. I need to be at the bottom. Well, that's a big turnaround from earlier. Oh, oh God. I'm going a little too hard in the corner. I think I almost blew my engine just a while ago. I could hear the car. So I've been recording right now for, was that 16 minutes, 17 minutes on my uh, Elgato, so pretty much the same thing on my uh, face cam right now, so I think there's a strong chance that this face cam's not going to die, and this lab is going to turn out just fine. I Let's really hope, hope that's so. true. So we caught them, we caught them, just got to get to their... Uh, not their bumpers. Jeff Burton's back bumper. Jeff Burton. I remember bitch. Jeff Burton from earlier. He was blocking me for 41st place. He was in 41st and now he's in 12th. Uh, I don't know nice how that happened. I guess. There's Michael Waltrip, my teammate. He you can is do in 11th. It. Mine, 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 mine. No contact. Oh my god. He made sure that no contact was made right there. He moved up the track. Wait. Mm -hmm. That wasn't for position? What the? Oh, he's a lap down. Is he a lap down? Okay, Mike Waltrip's not lap down, so that means Mike Waltrip is in 13th now. How is Jeff Burton so far behind? Because he sucks. I don't know. I mean, he was with the rest of the field. I don't know what's going on anymore now. Okay, I'm trying not to make contact, shitty but my car keeps shitty getting tight in the corner, and I can't get off of Dave Reagan for the life of me. Ugh. You He's taking me away, away from the rest of the field. He's not letting me stick with the pack because we keep getting stuck together. It's like if I try to get oh off gosh. of him, my car gets loose. But if I try not to get off of him, then I just we get stuck and start going up the track. Two okay, to two go. laps to go. Got to dive underneath Jeff Green right here. Oh, oh. my God! I dove underneath. Hey, oh. hey, hey, hey. Jeff Green! No. Jeff Green! You flipped out. My ass is is um oh, no. rubbing its single berries on the wall. That's not good. What? Oh my God! <laughs> uh, was that Elliot Sauter or Casey Kane that almost drove right into me? I don't know. Um, I tried diving underneath him. He saw me coming, but he just he came across my front Jeff bumper, Green's and then I wound up dumping him. Okay, that was Casey Kane behind me that I saw. I don't know if you saw that, but Casey Kane almost flat out drove right into me. After yeah, this I happened. saw him coming along. I don't think it showed up in the replay, though. Yeah, well, not from this camera angle. So is this going to end under caution now, or are we going to have ourselves restart? So that I can spin my tires again and lose this oh, entire race. Oh, God. That'd be nice. Okay. Did I lose positions during that? No, we're still 11. No. Okay, don't spin the tires. Don't spin oh. the tires. Uh. Don't spin tires. No! Oh no. my god. Spin the tires! Stop it! Stop! Let me go! Oh my god! I hate this damn game. Okay, now we gotta catch back up Come to those on. guys. So I can get into the top 10. I don't think I can because they're very far away. I hate this game so much right now, and I hate you too, Jeff Green, you freaking don't want to let me underneath you. I was there, but you just kept trying to block. Okay, you're right there in front of me. I can do this. We got one lap. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Come That's on. like the only phrase I know right now. I can Come do this. On. I can do this. I, I, I'm I catching them little oh. by little. I can do this. Uh, That's probably not going to do anything. Oh. I, I can't do this. I can't do this. No, okay, no, well, I spun the tires at the start of the race, and it took me like eight laps to catch the back of the field and start making up positions. So the fact that I finished in the top half of the field, I suppose, is nice. We got 11th place. Mark Martin won the race. At least it wasn't Kurt Busch, or especially John Wood. I hate John Wood. John Wood is the worst thing to ever be created by EA Sports <laughs> because he's not supposed to be doing that well whatsoever. He should have finished behind me along with all the other drivers that aren't supposed to be finishing behind me. So, so on a scale from 1 to 10, how did that race exactly go? I mean, um, after the way it started, I would say that was like a, that was a solid 7. A, a solid 7. Yeah. Michael Rubes, you yeah. heard it first, guys. He gave me a 7. 
I, I feel Yay. like a goddess now. Marry me. Mark Martin started in seventh and finished in first. He led 14 laps. Is that the most laps led? No, it's not. So I guess Matt Kenseth, because he was up front for the longest time. Uh, Kurt Busch started third, finished in second. John Wood started 19th, finished in third. Ryan Newman started 10th, finished in fourth. David Gillen started in fourth and finished in fifth, so he was one of those drivers to stay up there for the longest. Um, Martin Trex Jr., our previous NASCAR Cup champion, started 17th, finished in sixth. Kyle Busch started on pole and dropped back to finish in seventh. I mean, I remember him being in like, what was it, 19th yeah, what, place? How did he come back? So, I don't know, I guess his picker did his job. Oh, God. For a second, I thought Jeff Burton was on the lead lap, but that surprised me whenever I passed him. Didn't get third, well, didn't get 12th or whatever it was. Dale Earnhardt Jr. started in sixth and finished in ninth. Jeff Green started in ninth and finished in tenth. I skipped over Matt Kenseth, but he started second, finished eighth, led 18 laps, which is practically all the other laps in this race. Um, we only had one lead change, so that was between Matt Kenseth and uh, Mark Martin. Kyle Busch started out in pole, by the way, for those who don't remember, and he actually did not lead a single lap. <laughs> Matt Kenseth probably made it work on the outside. And we can look through the rest of the race results. Here's us. Started 43rd, finished in 11th. It could have been much worse, even it though it should have been. been much better. But it wasn't. Michael Waltrip started in 8th and finished in 12th. So, I mean, he couldn't keep it in the top 10, but at least he managed to finish in the top 15. I don't know. What about uh, Dale Jarrett? He didn't start very well, and he was doing well, and then he dropped all the way back again. Dale? Dale. What the hell happened? Dale Jarrett's only good whenever I'm racing as him in NASCAR 2005, apparently, because he started 37th, finished in 40th. There's Jeff Gordon, started in 5th and finished in 39th Ouch. somehow. Um, Gordon fans ain't liking this video. Scott Riggs, yeah, we passed him early on. He started 25th and finished in 43rd. Led, not led 7 laps, ran 7 laps. And one of the drivers that finished the lap down was actually Dale Jarrett. I don't even recall lapping him, but apparently we did. And um, there's Jeff Burton right there. He was the first guy that I lapped. So I guess Dale Jarrett wasn't lapped by me, he was just lapped by the leader way ahead somewhere. After our 11th place finish at the Monster Mile, Kyle Busch is in 2nd place, 284 points back. Tony Stewart is in 3rd, 382 back. Michael Waltrip is still in 4th, 493 back. Some of this really isn't changing. Uh, there's Ryan Newman, 521 back. John Wood has moved up into 6th. He's in 556 points back. I can't commentate, but John Wood, you suck. Jeff Green is in 7th, 609 points back. Robbie Gordon is in 8th, 614 points back. Bobby Labonte is in 9th, 635 points back. And Clint Boyer rounds out the top 10, 677 back. So, realistically, only Ryan Newman, Tony Stewart, and Kyle Busch belong in this top 10. But this is NASCAR, wait, for the PlayStation 2, and it's stupid. There's Jimmy in 11. Jimmy! He's trying to get back into the top 10, um, but he will make the chase if he keeps it right there. Ken Schrader's also aiming to make the chase. Dale Earnhardt Jr. is in 13th, so he's right along the line. And then you can look at the rest of the point standings. Blah, bitty, blah, bitty, blur, bitty, blah. Dale Jarrett was in 22nd place after Charlotte, and now he's 28th. That sucks. I mean, he was in 27th after Darlington, and he moved up five positions doing the race at Charlotte, and now he's in 28th. So he just lost all the progress that we practically made this week. Hmm. Dale Jarrett, god dang it, how'd you manage to finish a whole lap down? Dale Jarrett, I mean, he was moving through the field from what I remember, but yeah. I don't know what happened. What his picker did for him. His picker lost him an entire lap, but that's kind of sad if you ask me. Um, we didn't lap him, but I guess it was just the leaders, and that is the point settings. I recently found out that Greg Biffle is not competing at all in this season. He's just, yeah. He's just not. Yeah. That, that's really um, weird. I mean, his car is in the game. I went to race now mode and, and found out that his car is actually in the game, but he's just not competing in the season. Mm. That sucks I because I, I did an LP in NASCAR 09 with Greg Biffle, and that was because it was an amazing paint scheme, and this game is painting. Paint schemes suck so bad that they're not even letting him race. <laughs> that's, that's savage right there by EA Sports. I would say so. So, thanks for joining me for this video, Michael Maroogs. It's been a pleasure having you to, no to ease the suffering that is the fact that I can't start a freaking race in this game. <laughs> oh, it was cool. Thanks for having me along for the ride. In the next episode, we are going to Pocono Raceway for the Pocono 500, which will be race 14 of 36. 
my favorite track in all of NASCAR. Uh, and you're actually, you actually live rather close to that track as well, don't you, Michael? Yeah, Pocono's probably like an hour away. Mm. And uh, another YouTuber, What If Racing, that's his home track, as well as my friend Dale Reynolds, I suppose. Mm. But that's enough I can say. I don't want my phone to die before I can finish recording this video and lose my face cam footage again. So, one last goodbye from Michael. Goodbye! See you next time. That's that. And goodbye! <laughs> Episode over.